Alupo Jessica Rose Pell. Honorable Nam Gonzaloa, the esteem of Parliament in the eyes of the public, belittled the presiding officers of the House, its members, and consequently the people of Uganda who elected those leaders in line with their constitutional mandate. Her conduct brought Parliament and its members into disrepute and breached paragraph 5 of the Code of Conduct in Appendix 5 of the Rules of Procedure of Parliament. I vote. Yes. Right, Honorable Speaker, for purposes of bringing back sanity in this house, and respect for you as our honorable, right, Honorable Speaker, and rules of procedure of this August House, I vote yes. I vote yes. I'm not voting yes or no. One of the reasons as to why I'm here is service delivery. I want to vote no, a big no. Those who have abstained are three. Those who have voted no are five. And those who have voted yes to the motion are 348. <laughs> hereby declare that the motion has been carried, that Honorable Namganza passes, be censured, and as required under Rule 109, uh, Subrule 13 of our Rules of Procedure, I will inform the President accordingly within 24 hours. Um, dealing with those other ministers, because there are many, those who are, who would what can Parliament do? Your work is on your advisory. You cannot do much. They should know that you cannot just attack Parliament, uh, go against the, the rules of procedure, go against the constitution, uh, build of parliament, and then go away with it. For me, it is a lesson for all the ministers. You know, in this world, humility and working together with people is very important. Honorable Francis Namogaza, she was insinuating that all members of parliament are not sober, and she thinks she's the only one who is sober. Therefore, since she used to undermine all members of parliament, and she refused to work with other members of parliament. You remember she was invited several times to appear before the committee and she used to ignore and insult everybody. We knew she has been meeting the committees, different committees, and the committees have wrote a report, some either biased or not, but her not appearing to defend herself in front of everybody in the floor parliament, it was another sign of respecting the house. And that's why I voted yes. In that seven cabinet, they are participating in reducing it to half. Because many of the ministers, they are useless. In fact, tomorrow, even if they bring another one without a reason, I will censure. Because first, we should never have had a big cabinet. Two, we should never have had a cabinet of useless people. But we ended up with but parliament's participation. They are the ones who voted Namuganza and passed her. So I'm just helping parliament to correct its own mistake. They must be very careful in the future.